Good morning. Welcome to your 15 daily operations weather briefing. We'll have some hot conditions across the region the, today with temperatures in the lower 90s. Heat indices will be around the actual temperature with uh, dew points still in the 60s today. So not much of a heat index issue today, but it will be hot. We'll see a very slight chance of a pop-up shower or thunderstorm mainly north and uh, east of our area today. But overall, shouldn't see any lightning or precipitation today and just seeing those hot conditions. So taking a look at our current surface analysis, we have a front currently across the Plain States. It's going to be approaching our area for Thursday. A weak trough is a typical with a Bermuda high off our coast uh, just on the east side of the Appalachian Mountains. And that's going to fire off some of the showers and thunderstorms along the Appalachian Mountains today. But they'll weaken as they move towards the region and most likely won't see anything crossing the Chesapeake Bay today from the west. Taking a look at our current observation, a broken deck around 25,000 feet. Winds out of the west at 6 knots, temperature 77 degrees, and relative humidity at 73%. So taking a look at our current satellite imagery, you can see we do have the cloud cover around 25,000 feet, spiraling around the high that's currently off the southeast coast and coming in from the north over our area. And that's giving us that broken deck at that level. Looking at our 3-kilometer NAM model for today, here is uh, 9 a.m. this morning, moving on to noon, nothing coming close to the region. Then by about 2 to 3 o'clock this afternoon, model is picking up a, a pop-up shower around Ocean City or a thunderstorm. And you can see here, peaking at around 4 o'clock this afternoon. Uh, and as I mentioned, that's going to give us that very slight chance of seeing something here at Wallops. Most likely that will remain uh, north and east of our area and we won't see anything other than uh, some cumulus clouds across the region today. Moving the overnight hours, we're going to see that weak trough, as I mentioned, kind of sliding down towards the region. That's going to give us a slight chance to a very slight chance of a shower moving through, but as I mentioned, most likely this activity will not make it across the Chesapeake Bay, and we'll just see a little bit of increased cloudiness overnight. And for our Wednesday, we're going to see another very similar setup for today. A slight chance of a pop-up shower thunderstorm. We'll see a slightly better opportunity here at Wallops of seeing a shower thunderstorm tomorrow, but overall uh, chances are slim or slight. As we move into Thursday, we'll see a front try to move towards the region. That's going to give us some shower thunderstorm chances. As far as a risk chart today, we'll see a high of 91, so a hot day, a low tonight of 71. We'll see winds off the land. It's going to give us those warm temperatures. And we'll see those out of the west to southwest around 7 to 12 knots today, and then becoming southwesterly overnight, and then finally northwesterly tomorrow morning at 5 to 10 knots. We'll see our VFR conditions this morning continuing throughout the next 24 hours. We'll see a slight chance of a rain shower or thunderstorm in the vicinity between 1400 local and 1700 local, and we'll see a slight chance of a shower in the area tonight with that activity trying to slide in from the west, but overall uh, most likely won't see that. And all chances today of uh, showers or thunderstorms will be below uh, 15%. So for Wednesday and Thursday, Wednesday partly cloudy and warm, slight chance of an afternoon shower or thunderstorm, high of 86, and as I mentioned, a slightly higher chance tomorrow only about a 20% of that occurring here at Wallops. For Wednesday night, partly cloudy to mostly clear and warm, low of 70. And for Thursday, we'll have an active day across the region as it looks. Mostly clear to partly cloudy in the morning, then partly to mostly cloudy during the afternoon and evening with scattered showers and thunderstorms. Some of those storms could be strong to severe, and we'll see a high around 86 degrees. The only oranges for our uh, shower and thunderstorm activity looks like around a 60% chance right now. Uh, we'll continue to refine that as we move closer to Thursday, and we'll see some chances of low ceilings and visibility with the thunderstorms moving through the area. Well, that's going to complete our 815 Daily Operations Weather Brief. I hope everybody had a great day today. We're back at 10 o'clock to look at the next seven days.